Okay, good morning, welcome to. Math 440. Math 440. So I asked you guys what you wanted to do today, and you wanted to do a little bit more with um, neural networks, which is which is uh, going to be really fun. So what is it that you'd like to take a look at with neural networks today? Well, I this saw nice. these functions on the top that we only really used for learning, right? Okay. So I wanted to take a look at them. You wanted to play with those different functions? Yeah. Okay. All right. So maybe... What's the activation? Yeah, activation actually is a is a interesting one. So, so that one I actually can explain a little bit. Regularization, I think, um, is going to be a little bit too hard, and also the problem type. I, I bet we can play with. What are, what are the choices on problem type? Um, problem type. Classification and regression. Okay. What does that mean? Yeah, I can I can explain these things. Um, so click on cl switch it over to regression and see what happens. Okay. So oh, but there it seems like there's these white dots and there's some orange and some blue, but there's yeah. So um, classification is what we were looking at yesterday, right? Yeah, yeah. classifying the types of dots. Yeah, so that's trying to say. Um, do you have an orange dot or a blue dot? Yeah. But let's see what happens when we're looking at what they're calling regression. Here, why don't you just run it as it is right now and see what it does. So, I think what it's doing is it's saying which general area is blue and which general area is orange. Yeah. Yeah, that's interesting. It seems to be getting it pretty good here. Do you want to add some noise in and see what the data looks like when you have noise here? Okay. Um, yeah, noise. that's the noise. Okay, so you added a lot of noise. Or maybe we can add like a little bit of noise. noise. Okay. Now they're uh, kind of all jumbled together. Well, they're not totally jumbled together. Let's see. So, but. Only a little bit of loss. Yeah. Still kind of getting them right. Uh huh. But they're like those white dots in the middle of the orange dots and the blue dots. Are those those the dots that you're gonna add? Yeah. So let me zoom in a little bit, and now I'll show, I'll show you the difference. I guess I gotta scoot the camera over. Got my frisbee videos in the background there. All right. So here, the this is telling you now when the dot is really or orange, it's sort of weighted by uh, a, a minus one. That means that it's, it's not the kind of thing you're looking for, say. Or it might, let, let me give a better example, height. So really short to really tall. Yeah. You see, and then as you move across the, the um, data this way, in this direction, yeah. you seem to be going from really short to really tall. So you notice there's a, a pattern, a, or a linear, maybe a linear pattern, or some kind of pattern going across the screen. So if you know you're up here, you're really tall, and if you know you're down here, you're really short. And that's, so you're not trying to necessarily classify whether it's orange or blue here, but you're also trying to classify like how blue is it. Hmm. You see, hmm. so I can yeah, I can sort of see it getting paler as it goes out. Yeah, and getting blue as it goes in. Yeah, so it's a slightly it seems like a slightly more complicated problem, right? But it mm -hmm. it, it it seems to do pretty well here, um, and I don't know why they only have one set of data. But why don't we? No, they have another. One. See another. Oh, is there? Okay, great. Ooh, ooh. Okay, so before we run this one, this, should we? Yeah, take the noise away if you want. So this still is pretty complicated. Yeah, this looks pretty complicated. So what do you think? What do you think is going on here? Hmm. Well, you have this. Well, most of them are white here. It looks like. Okay. There's like a few orange. There's like these three orange clumps and these three blue clumps. Okay. All of them are white. All right. So maybe here there'll be like this sort of two intersecting triangles to oh. see how blue it is. Okay, well let's see what it does here with this data. So, 
So yeah, it, it's kind of. So it's, it's sort of split the region into sixth. Huh. So even here, it was able to identify, and this this one, like I, I said last time, I used the word linear, but by sort of by accident. Here, there's definitely not a linear relationship. Last last time, it was sort of as we were going across yeah. this way. Here, there's some some uh, groups. Well, mm -hmm. but also with these top and bottom triangles, there's something going on because, like, the very top is blue, but there's an orange triangle. The very bottom is orange, but there's a blue triangle. Yeah. So I guess that means there'll be orange, kind of orange, dots there. Okay. You can sort of see it's a pretty faint orange, like really close to white. Yeah. But all of them are pretty faint. Yeah, it's interesting how. Between blue, yeah. How it's uh, how it's doing here. All right, so let's let's go um, let's go to the next movie.